And here we are at Dawnstar. Look at all these little houses. Time to go in every single one of them. Barracks. You keep your distance with that magic. You come to Dawnstar at a strange time, friend. Seems everyone in the town is having nightmares. Trouble? What is it, boy? Jail? You're that one from the college. Heard about you. You should go uh. to Rust Lake. Get some proper steel. Uh, proper steel? What's this? What's this? The inn. Ah, here we go. Perfect. The inn always has the rumors. The rumors lead to quests. to be. I I've got to get out of this town. Irgner, get a hold of yourself. They're just dreams. Please tell her, Erandur. Listen to your friend, Fuki. They are just dreams, my dear. I assure you that it is quite normal. It's the same dream over and over again. You think that's normal? It's evil, I tell you. Erandur, she has a point. You keep telling us no harm will follow these dreams. But they must be an omen. Give him a chance to speak. He's trying to help us. Everyone, please. I'm doing what I can to end these nightmares. In the meantime, all I ask is you remain strong and put your trust in Lady Mar. What troubles you? The entire town is being plagued by horrible nightmares. They're in serious danger, but I'm afraid there's little <laughs> I can do about it. These dreams are manifestations created by the Daedric Lord, Vermina. She has an awful hunger for our memories. In return, she leaves behind nightmares. Not unlike a cough marks a serious illness. I must end her terrible influence over these people before the damage becomes permanent. I need to return to the source of the problem, to Nightcaller Temple. Perhaps you'd be willing to assist me in... I've already said too much. If anyone overhears what we're saying, it could start a panic. I would simply ask that you trust me and help me end Dawnstar's nightmares. Wonderful. My Lady Mara will be quite pleased. Nightcaller Temple is only a short walk from Dawnstar. Come, we must hurry. Vermina resides in a strange realm known as Quagmire, a nightmarish land where reality shifts upon itself in seemingly impossible ways. From her citadel at the center, she reaches forth to collect our memories, leaving nothing in return apart from visions of horror and despair. Who can say? Perhaps she collects them for display like works of art in a nonsensical art gallery. Whatever the case may be, her intentions are far from benevolent. I promise to answer all of I your questions. I envy you, travelers. Follow me. Yes. Ever since my mother died a few winters ago, I play songs and help with the drinks when I have the time. My mother taught me. She was a bard from the college in solitude. I hear they accept most people who apply, if you're ever interested. I'd better get going. Need a room? Everyone in town knows about the Black Door, and to never go near it. Let's sate that appetite, huh? Until next time. I assume the Black Door is the, uh... Ugh, would you mind dousing Dark that Brotherhood, magic? but I'm already sort of there. Yeah, Dark Brotherhood, probably.
You keep your distance with that magic. Oh, okay. God, these loading screens. Oh, they haunt me in my dreams. It's like save dream over and over. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. Years ago, this temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. They were being plagued by nightmares just like the people of Dawnstar. Before we enter, years ago, this temple... No. Knowing they could never defeat the orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma, putting everyone to sleep. I'm concerned that when this place is unsealed, the miasma will dissipate and they'll awaken, both orcs and priests alike. The miasma was created by the priests of Vermina for their rituals. It's a gas that places the affected in a deep sleep. Because the rituals would last for months or even years, the miasma was designed to slow down the aging process. Sadly, yes. The longer an individual is exposed to the miasma, the more the mind can become damaged. Those who've been under the effect of it for extended periods of time have been known to lose their minds entirely. In some cases, a few never awoke at all. all right. Once we get inside, all will become clear. I... Just a moment, and I'll have this open. Behold 
the skull of corruption, the source of Dawnstar's woes. We must reach the inner sanctum and destroy it. Come, there's no time to lose. Possible, actually. Hmm. I wonder. There may be a way to bypass the barrier, but I must check their library and confirm it can be done. I suppose there's no point in concealing the truth any longer. My knowledge of this temple comes from personal experience. I was a priest of Vermina. When the orcs invaded the temple, I fled. I left my brothers and sisters here to die. I've spent the last few decades living in regret and seeking redemption for Mara. And by her benevolence, I will right my wrongs. I still have my key to the library. Whenever you're ready, let's move on. Lore holds that the Skull of Corruption holds a constant hunger for the memories of others. The Skull has been out of touch for so long. I fear it's gained the ability to reach out on its own and try to feed. What it does with these memories is just conjecture, and an argument for scholars and historians to this very day. We mustn't tarry. The skull needs to be destroyed as soon as possible. So stop walking, run. Steps. Come on, dude. I'm walking like it's three just times faster here. than you. You're like crawling here. Actually, I can crawl faster than you can walk. Be careful. We're certain to find more of the awakened within. They mustn't stop us. <laughs> Sorry. Varieties of data. Books. Shit. Hot coals. Why is this? What's with this? Lag spikes. Oop. Okay. What is this? Dream stride. Oof. That's a thick book. Just standing there. Hello? Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Is there a problem? We mustn't tarry. The skull needs to be. I don't need that. Jazargo. Uh. Hey. Jazargo. What? So, subscribe! <laughs>